Enough with the back and forth. Let's end this animosity between us right now. Okay, fine, fine. What do you want to talk about then, Hunter? I want to know more on Tony's side of things. So, Tony, why do you hate us? I'll talk if you let me promote Dynamite first. You gotta be fucking shitting me. Come on, Tony, we're not in an interview. Don't care. Either I promote the best weekly wrestling show or I won't talk about it and you guys can take this big, fat, juicy L and pay for a free meal for me, bitches. Where's the fucking young bucks when you need them? As a matter of fact, I'll put them in a new neck brace myself. Shut it, Sean. We gotta swallow the pill sometime, so let's just let him. Nah, fuck that. He can swallow my shriveled up wrinkly dick for all I care. Fuck his mid-ass show. What you say, you cross-eyed, washed up bitch? Trick Williams carries your boring ass show. You need my talent to keep it relevant, you fucking dinosaur. Time to tune up the band. For the love of God, both of you shut the fuck up. Jesus. Sean just let him promote dynamite, and I'll talk with TKO to give you a pay rise. Okay, fine. At least I get paid for this. Go on ahead, Tony. Glad you got your side bitch to quiet down. Now on to more important things. Hey, lovely fans, you should tune into dynamite. All right, I got my bosses and the nerdy dweeb to serve, so I gotta give them the best food from the ranch. Let's do this! There, all done. Can't wait to see the demo. Now tell us, Tony, what problems do you have with us? Come on, H, keep it real. You tried burying my company back in the Wednesday Night Wars, but then I obliterated you in the ratings so bad your own father-in-law kicked you out of your job, which you deserved for calling AEW a pissant company. But yet now you want to come at me with a moral high horse just because you're running the show now. So stop getting a big nose about it. Damn. Tell us how you really feel. Come on, Tony. That was all in the past. Yes, I acknowledge I did do all of that. I can also admit the pressure from the WWE and Vince made me act carelessly. But we got to let it be water under the bridge now and just make the best shows we can for the fans. I'm sorry, man. Well, I can kind of respect that from you, but I don't know if I can accept the apology just yet because there's still a lot I got to say, but to HBK this time. Oh boy, here we go. Dude, you're literally trying to do what Triple H did, but worse, you literally relied on part-timers just to compete with my show. And you still can't beat me, but you trash me and my show all the time. And now you both are stealing my talent. Cody Rhodes, Jade Cargill, Ethan Page, Sean Spears, like, come on. Okay, fuck this. I should say something, too. I have brought you all your food. Here you go. Wow, thanks, Brock. This all looks delicious. Thank you. Thanks, Brock. Uh-huh. You all enjoy your food now? I'll be serving other customers, so if you need me, feel free to let me know. All right, I got you, Brock. Now let's get back on track. What the hell were you going to say? I was going to say, get a pair of balls for once and grow the fuck up. This is a business, not a damn school dodgeball team or something. I can be here all day naming all the numerous WWE talent that's left our company in favor of yours, but you don't see me bitching about it now, do you? You adapt and move on, not fear for your life or tweet some internet bullshit about it. You clearly aren't made for this industry. That's why I make it clear as day that your show is dog water. Holy shit, Sean just cooked so hard. And so did Brock. The salad and milk combo slaps harder than Gunther in all of his matches. For real. And this Brock Burger is also making me want to go burger after burger, too. Did Tony even listen to a single fucking word I just said? Just launched two tweets. One about how this is a five-star classic meal, and two about how no one gives a fuck about a bald, out-of-touch boomer giving you a lecture about shit. Get ratioed, buddy. No way he just called you a boomer. Well, there's still other problems with AEW, lack of creating stars, long-ass pay-per-views, too many goddamn championships, Ric Flair and Chris Jericho, fangirling about Dave Meltzer of all people. Don't get me started with the CM Punk drama. Are you going to watch me bury your company six feet under or will you say something? Hmm? Fuck you, Sean. You don't understand shit. There's a perfectly good amount of titles and I'm too busy putting on five-star bangers on every show. Ha ha. Five-star Meltzer bangers. Get your head out of his ass. Did you see Double or Nothing? That shit was hot garbage. Fucking WCW 2000 level deplorable shit show. All of those matches clear your senior citizen main event match in Saudi back in 2018. You made wrestling look like a joke, so you got no room to talk here. So shut the fuck up and go back to booking your bathroom break PLEs while people tune in to my shows. Oh, please, you wish you could have people even show up. Thunderdome crowds were more packed than your all-empty arena shows. Forbidden Door is cooking up way better shit than your filler clash at the Castle B level PLE. Will Osprey versus Swerve is about to put your PLEs to shame. You're low-key copying the WWE, so I don't want to hear it from this next-gen Vince Russo. How am I copying you? 
give me a break. You're having a world champion versus mid-card champion storyline, just like Cody versus Logan Paul. Then you recently announced the winner of the Owen Hart Cup tournaments would be getting world title matches at All In. Right after Triple H did the same thing for King and Queen of the Ring, getting world title matches at SummerSlam. You can't make this shit up. N no, you're wrong. We're AW. We're the best wrestle. Yeah, yeah, yeah. More like AEW where we plagiarize, Cap! injure our entire roster, no, and sink you. in ratings faster Shut than the, the Titanic. Fuck up. This is not about to end well, is it? You know what? You and Triple L can fuck off. Fuck squashing our beef. I hope Brock breaks your fucking arm again, Sean. This was a waste of my time. I'm taking my food to go. No Tony, wait. Go eat the dirtiest part of Vince's shit-filled ass. I'm out of here. Get my dad on the phone. Damn it, Sean. We could have finally ended this feud and maybe even start collabing with them, but now we can't. Who honestly gives a fuck about Tony Clown's opinion these days? If he was a real boss, he wouldn't have been butthurt over a bunch of facts I was spitting. Am I wrong, Hunter? Um, okay, fine, to be honest. His shows are pretty mediocre, and you were this close to having me crack up right in front of him. There was not a single lie detected. I just thought it'd be the right thing to do, but I always have another time to try and change his mind. Good point. Just make sure you do it just between the two of you, or else I'd bust out the old crotch chop. Hey, <laughs> never change, Sean. Never change. Wow, you guys appear to be done. But where did your guy's little friend go? Don't worry about him. He took his food to go. Don't worry, I'll be paying for all the food today, Brock. The food was absolute peak. You deserve every last penny on this bill. Why, thank you, sir. Also, thanks for the payment. You guys have a good night now. You too, Brock. Take care. Well, gee golly gosh, is that DX? Oh, hey, Seth. How's it going? Good. Just beat the shield and became the Mario Kart chief. Now I'm getting victory food for the boys. Mario Kart, huh? Say, Seth, tell me more about it. 